but Swindon and West Brom were also beaten. Relegation haunted Oldham to leave them on the verge of a historic achievement for the club. Here's Don Riddell. It's been a long, hard season at Oakwell, but with just a few games to go, Barnsley know they could soon be celebrating their centenary by playing in the top flight for the first time ever in their history. Manager Danny Wilson has steered them to within two wins of an automatic promotion spot, thanks in part to a 2-0 win over Oldham. The fans have compared watching Barnsley to Brazil this season. Well, it wasn't quite that exciting, but they wouldn't have been complaining when John Hendry poked them into the lead on the stroke of half-time. The Trinidadian international Clint Marcel clinched all three points shortly into the second half with a cool chip over Gary Kelly. They're almost there, but the manager isn't getting carried away just yet. No, don't be silly now. No, it's, um, you know, it, it's another step closer, obviously, but um, you know, we're certainly not going to get carried away with the result. You know, we've got four very uh, tough games to come, three of those are away from home. You know, so um, from my point of view, we, uh, we just can't relax at this moment in time. I wish we could, but unfortunately we can't. All credit to Barnsley. I think good luck to them. I hope they, they get as many points as they can now. It's nice to have another Yorkshire club in the Premiership, or other than the big boys, and I'm sure they'll get some good results next year. And it surely won't be too long before the real party gets underway at Oakwell. So congratulations to Barnsley. It was good to be at Oakwell last night, showing no bias. Of course, we'll be keeping fingers crossed for the right results uh, at the weekend.